Alrighty guys, Kentucky basketball is back right now at six o'clock tonight. If you're seeing this video, which I posted at six o'clock on the nose, uh, Kentucky plays tonight against Moorhead State. They're playing right now against Moorhead State. They're getting ready to play right now. And uh, who knows what to expect, people. Kentucky enters the season, preseason number 10. Um, we don't really know what to expect this season. It's gonna be a very interesting season. I expect to have games canceled, uh, but I expect the season to continue. So we got freshman Allen, uh, Dantea Allen, Dantea Allen. Look at our newcomers here. Former Mr. Kentucky has not played since 2008 when he tore his ACL in his knee. That's interesting. We'll see how he goes. Uh, we have Devin Askew, freshman. Let's see. West Coast kid, uh, BJ Boston, freshman guard. BJ plays with a dollar bill and one shoe. By this time next year, he's almost certain to have millions more. Uh, I'd say so, another case. I mean, I don't know what to expect from this year, people. I don't really know. I'm just looking at uh, Keon Brooks is coming back. Okay, we know but we all know all about him. Terrence Clark is a freshman coming in. Terrence Clark's game. Uh, top ten recruit. Let's see. Versatile. He's gonna be one of Kentucky one of the biggest things in Kentucky, okay. Now let's see what else. Cameron Fletcher, another freshman coming in. Freshman from Vaston High School in St. Louis, really talented. They say, of course, of course, everybody on Kentucky is talented, right? It's all a matter of putting it together. Number 65 ranked prospect in the class of 2021, Isaiah Jackson, freshman forward. It's a surprise. It's really surprising. Basketball freshman's once considered an. Under the radar prospect, and then the Wildcats no more recruit class 2020. Now one of the most buzz players. Of, now he's one of the most buzz players in 2020-21 UK roster. I mean, look at all these freshmen. Let's see, Devon Immense, freshman, graduate transfer, will be counted on to mentor his five-star freshman teammates. Oh, he's a graduate student. Okay, he's not a freshman. Okay, well, it's a dual role for him. Okay. And we got Oliver Starr. Okay, senior. Oliver Starr. Oliver Saar. Saar. Olivia Saar. Olivia Starr. Saar, whatever. <laughs> Kentucky basketball fans. Quest for updates on Saar's transfer waiver could not arrive could not could rival the number seven foot okay he's not playing right now okay so he's not playing right now the NCCAA see, has approved his request for a waiver to avoid normal requirements of digital transfer he could now play for Kentucky this year okay okay so he's playing okay so that's good uh, Jacob Topin. Let's see. Much about him. Let's see. Lance Wire, freshman. Might go down as the most important shoe tying in Kentucky basketball history. What? Seventh grade measured measuring at close to okay in seventh grade he was on six five in seventh grade okay so all right whatever this this young man is pretty coordinated to be six four and to be the age he was okay let's see is that it so there you have it people there's a sneak peek into what's coming i don't know what's coming you know we got all these great stories about our kids coming in uh, we'll see how it goes tonight. We got another game Sunday night, but tonight Moorhead State. We'll see what the team's all about. We'll take a more in-depth look after this game. We'll look at the schedules coming up, the players, all that stuff. We'll, we'll find out more about the players, and we'll see how it goes from here. Because I don't know what to expect from any of these players. I don't know. I don't guess they've been been able to really practice that much either. I don't guess. But um, 
we'll see how it goes. That's all I can say, pretty much. So, as always, guys, thanks so much for watching. Let me know how you feel about this Kentucky team. At preseason number 10, that's that's better than being number one for a change. Not a, there's less pressure on the team, and we'll just see how it goes from here. From all the things I've read, we have as much talent as anybody, and it's always the same story every year. Can Kentucky put that talent together to make something special? I don't know. But anyway, guys, as always, thanks so much for watching. Enjoy the game right now. It is on the SEC Network, I think. And have a great day, and as always, go Big Blue.